Well, it's, I think it is possible to learn to be innovative. You know, a lot of times for, for any given thing, uh, you have to say, did you try? This may sound, sound obvious, uh, but actually try. Like you, if, if, so, if somebody might wonder, well, can I be innovative? Well, have you tried? Try thinking of interesting ideas. I, I mean, I, I do find a good source of, of innovation is if you, read, if you read about a whole bunch of fields, you can cross fertilize ideas from one field into another. And so you can synthesize, so you take say SpaceX and Tesla, the automotive industry is very good at, at manufacturing. Um, it, it's a, in terms of manufacturing complex machines at volume, the automotive industry is the best. The, the, now the rocket industry, space industry is very good at advanced materials and making things very light. Um, and uh, and so, so taking advanced materials and mass optimization uh, concepts from the space industry, applying it to automotive and taking automotive mass manufacturing techniques and applying it to space was kind of like a superpower. When you're talking about innovating though, and you said people can try, that means you have to be willing to let them fail. If you're not failing at least some of the time, you're not trying hard enough. You have to fail some of the time. It's more like a batting average. Somebody should have a good batting average, but nobody bats a thousand.